What's good, YouTube? This is the Wise Bro. I'm back at it again with another shoe review, you guys. Now, today I'm going to be talking about the old style of uh, basketball shoes and the new style basketball shoes. And I'm going to give you reasons why I prefer the old style over the new style. Now, today we're going to be talking about the Steph Curry Under Armour Championship 4 shoes. Now, these shoes are, they're pretty good. They're pretty good. I'm not going to totally hate on the shoe. I mean, Steph Curry did, you know, win championships he is a champion so i'm not gonna hate too bad on it but i have to say that the shoe is not as comfortable as you think now the reason why i don't think this shoe is really good for let's say everyday you know walking around number one it is a very very hard shoe steph curry's shoe is like i say he, he I, I was told that he likes or i read about that he likes to you know some really hard solid you know shoes type shoes you know i don't really dig them because the sole in it was very very i mean it really didn't fit me you know i mean i really felt very uncomfortable in the shoe very stiff at the bottom um didn't have a lot of give and take i mean it does have a pretty good stitching at the top of the shoe you know like a sock kind of you know fit which i think is very unique and um, i think more basketball shoes should be designed that way because you're constantly pivoting and stopping so at the around the ankles you need a lot more movement now Overall, the shoe, like say, it has a pretty good look to it. Uh, I like the two-tone colors, you know, that it has. I'm not really into three or four different types of colors in the shoe because that way, you know, you don't really, you can't really cut a color coordinate really well with different outfits, you know, different joggers and so forth. So I do like that about the shoe. Um, I like that it's it's got the stitching at the top, okay. And um, I also like that it has, you know, some good ventilation throughout the shoe. Now, those are the three pros that I like about the Steph Curry. The three cons are the shoe is very stiff. <laughs> Given it, you know, as far as on the, the insole part of it, I don't think that it's very padded. It's not very well padded at the bottom. Okay. And um, for long distance walking, if you're going to be in the shoe more than an hour to two hours, three, you know, any anywhere between beyond three hours in that particular shoe, you're gonna experience quite a bit of discomfort. Now, I would say if you are experiencing this discomfort, I would definitely go to your nearest shoe store and pick up an insole. Um, I found a really good insole um, at Foot Locker. Um, it's like a plantar fasciitis insole, and it's a really, really good insole to put in any type of shoe. This shoe in particular, you know, is, is really good to put in, especially if you're flat footed. I would definitely recommend putting this particular type of insole in your shoe. It's going to give you a lot of comfort and you will make it throughout through the day if you have this in the shoe. But just wearing the shoe as is, is not enough. Like I said, it, it all depends on your foot, the, you know, the, the makeup of your foot, the design of your foot, whether you have an arch or you don't. So really do your research on that. But like I said before, I will definitely not recommend this shoe for any type of walking if you're going to be in it you know for an extended period of time i would definitely not recommend the steph curry on the armor four championship edition, edition shoes now the next shoe we're going to be talking about are the converse chuck taylors yo i'm telling you the chuck taylors are off the hook man now the chuck taylors can be worn on in any i mean they're they're, they're used in all types of sports you got powerlifters using these shoes. I mean, bodybuilding. I mean, it's it's very very sturdy. The shoe has a lot of give and take. So, if you if you're you know moving around a lot, you can make sudden stops. The shoe is gonna really give naturally to the foot. Okay. Now I'm gonna give you three things that I really really love about the shoe. The first thing is the the stitching around the shoe. It's a cloth type stitching around the shoe as far as the upper part of the shoe, not this not the sole. And I really like that. I mean, it's really, really, I mean, it's phenomenal the way that this shoe holds up. I've seen people use it for deadlifting. I've seen people use it for all types of sports. Now, I mean, it's an amazing shoe and I would definitely recommend it. Chuck Taylor, Converse, man, these shoes have been around for a long time, a long time. And I'm telling you, it is by far the best shoe they come in all assortments of colors. I mean, they got two tones, they got three tones. They have a whole different assortment of colors with this shoe. But for one, like I said, it's 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 all around the best shoe that I've ever, you know, owned. You can wear it for anything, all types of occasion. I see people with suits wearing Chuck Taylor. So it's an all around shoe and I would really, really recommend uh, if you wanna purchase a pair of those, 
Chuck Taylor's man, go ahead and pick one up. Pick one up, you guys. You will not be disappointed. Okay? Now, um, that's about it, you guys. I don't have anything more else to say about the shoes. But like I said, if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Share it out, you guys. And remember to subscribe today. And also, hit that notification button that will appear anytime you <laughs> are clicking on these videos, man. Hit that notification button so it will notify you of all my upcoming YouTube videos. All right, you guys, this is The Wise Bro. I'm out. Peace, love, and harmony in 2019 and beyond, you guys. Word is born. Peace.